all right on um, this segment we are looking at um, our page setup the page setup deals with the size of your document page setup gives you the area of the document you want to print and the page is guided by the margins see this shaded region here is your top margin scroll down here you have your bottom margin what it means is that your typing will start from the region here and will not go beyond this region so when you get to this region it goes to the next page similarly your typing start from this region here by the left and stop somewhere here when you get to this region it wraps to the next line so how do we adjust this you either put your cursor to this edge here when you put your cursor to this edge you click and hold when you see these two arrows you drag that to the right to expand it or to the left to contrast it so let's expand it means that we are increasing our working space you can also do similar to this increase this so you have a wider working space your document to be able to contain you can increase this okay um, there is no default to this it's not default it depends on the type of document you are working so when you have a document for instance you have a document and then um, the second page entered by um, second page entered by just um, by just by just um, this you know the second page entered by just this this is page two of two and it just this line and you needed it to compress into one line so all you need to do is what to adjust and find a way of um, adjusting it until now uh, it goes into this um, place. So we find a way of adjusting it to enter the second first page. So that's what page setup is about. We can get that from this page layout. Go to margin. Okay, go to customize. When you get to customize see our top has been set to um, 1.25 cm I can reduce it to 1 I can reduce this to 1 I can reduce this all of them to 1 so that gives me a see it reduced it reduced look at the top it reduced it's reduced if I want to use, um, I may decide to use my page layout, go to margin and do that. Alright, another page setup um, we need to look at is the page orientation. Page orientation, sometimes you have your document printing on this size, straight, which you call portrait. And you also have your document printed um, landscape. By default, it is on portrait. If I change the orientation to this landscape, we have it printed this way. So sometimes you may be working on the document. The document you are working on will tell you, okay, how do I want to lay my document? I want to lay it flat. I want to lay it straight. So flat is um, landscape and straight is portrait. Okay, let's look at another size. These are the paper sizes you want to print on. I want to print on letter, letter, and um, let A4 are almost the same size. So better is 21.59 by 27.94. So just a little difference by the letter is a, a bit wider than A4. Why A4 is what longer than a letter on that okay? So so now that you've learned about the paper um page setup orientation the next thing remains is for you to go back to our first lesson which is on typing and formatting and start typing whatever document that comes your way taking note that 
um, page setup is very very important it determines how um, arranged your document is and also it is determined by choice depending on where your document is going so most times if your document is um, an official document it is necessary to always use this um, for official document you use um, use um, can use um, two point two point one or two point zero top okay all through use two point zero it's okay to start at this point for official documents also um if your document has letterhead which we are going to discuss later you should be able to know how to set you measure the, the the height of the heading of that letter document then you now know where to that to drag this one down that this portion up here will be for the letterhead and your text and document content will now come 